So this is our dog sled, and uh, I think it turned out fairly well. It's got two little dogs, and uh, it's got the ropes to the sled. The sled has some skis on it, and it's shaped like a wedge. It, the dogs have these little legs down here um, supporting the dog, and uh, got their little tails flapping away, and their heads. And uh, you can see it just puts in around. You know, going across the screen, dog sledding it up. You know, I think it turned out fairly well. So um, don't forget to subscribe and comment down below. And uh, also go check out our giveaway video. We have a whole bunch of videos or a whole bunch of Legos that we're giving away over the course of our Lego, our YouTube milestones. So go check those out. Love to have you as a subscriber and part of our overall community. So let's go check out how I built this Lego dog sled. So we have a bonus day and I would like to build a dog sled. And I'm not sure how we're going to build a dog sled, but let's put five minutes on the clock and uh, find out how we're going to build a dog sled. So I'm excited about this build. Uh, let's go ahead and put something like this together, like that, maybe like that. That looks like a dog sled to me. You know, it's just, it's like a cone, or not a cone, but a, a wedge. And uh, maybe we put some, like our bobsled, maybe we put some skates on it, skis on it. We'll work on that later, but first we got to work on a dog. How are we going to build a dog? Okay, so we got browns. Maybe like a head and a tail? No, maybe a bigger head? Maybe the tail's this way. Yeah, that's the right proportion. Let's see what we can do. Can we do another one out of brown? Let me use these eyes. Maybe it has, no, no eyes. That throws everything off. Maybe it's spotted. Maybe it's got a brown, black spot right there, huh? That worked. So now we gotta tie it together somehow. Something like that, and then maybe like that. And then, oh, I can use these as legs, right? I can use these as little leggies. See what I mean? Oh, I gonna need to zoom out, huh? Sorry about that, everyone. Let's make sure that I'm focused in as well. I, I'm building small and I'm building too far away from me. Okay, so now I need little leggies for this guy. Don't I have another brown? There it is. Something like that and that. So now we got two little dogs. And now I gotta get, um, here we go. And maybe something like this. There, so then we got that on skis and we got two little dogs. That's not too bad. Now we got to find a way to connect them. Like like rope, which I don't have rope, but uh, maybe just something like this. Yeah, that works. Maybe we use the lighter one in the front so it doesn't hide the one in the back. That looks like a dog sled. What do you guys think? Maybe, I don't know. Let's try the tail a different way. Yep, that better. That's better. Matter of fact, and we might be even able to link it together here. Yep, that looks really good. Then, if we add something to that, 
I had I have two of those, don't I? I thought I had two of those. Where'd the other one go? That's just wrong. Don't I have two of those? I'm gonna put this back here so that it sits up a little bit better. Yeah, that one's been used. I swear I have two of those little one by two reddish brown pieces, but oh well. We are almost out of time. I'm still looking for that little reddish brown piece. I did some nulling and that would have, should have helped me. But now I'm losing, I lost a piece. Is it on the floor? Okay, well there you go. So that is our dog sled. Almost looks like a reindeer or Santa sleigh, almost. But winter sports, you know, this is one of the winter sports that's not well televised or talked about, and it's uh, dog sled. And I actually have a friend from high school that does um, does dog sledding up in Alaska, and she she does an amazing job with it. So there you go. So we got its little legs down here. Uh, we got a tail. We got the dog's face uh, or head. We got a little sled here that. Um, slopes up like a wedge like like the dog sleds that I've seen in the past it's on skis sitting up on skis so that's really cool so there you go there is a Lego dog sled leave a comment down below if you think we did a good job or leave a comment if you don't think we did a good job love to hear what you have as an opinion as to what how well we did with our little dog sled here um, I think it turned out fairly well um, it is kind of what I had in mind, but I actually was thinking of smaller dogs and more of them, but I don't have enough pieces. I, like I could do like a purple dog and add all these different colors to the dogs, but I think this turned out fairly well. I'm a little peeved off about the not having that color. I'm not sure where that piece went. Maybe it's attached to something else. I'm not sure. So I'm going to have to look for that. Um, if you have ever built a dog sled or just a dog out of Legos, love to see it. Why don't you go post it on our social medias, hashtag make share daily. And uh, love to see it. Love to comment on what you build, the community. I'd love to see the community's builds just as much as I love to share what I build each and every day. Make share daily. So don't forget to go out and build something today. Okay, well, let's go check out what we're going to build tomorrow. Well, that was a cool build. Now let's spin the wheel and find out what we're going to build tomorrow. Again, January is full of snow and ice, so we got snow and ice items on the board. So what do we got here? We got an ice castle. So I grew up near Lake Placid. There's a small town just north of there. They actually take ice blocks out of the river, and they put it on the ground, and they actually build a giant castle for the kids to play in each and every year. So, a nice castle. Not sure how we're going to build it out of Legos. We don't have that many translucent pieces. Um, but, last castle video that we did, did really well. So, hopefully the ice castle does as well. So, let's go check out how I built it tomorrow. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell for notifications of when our videos come out. Also, if you're subscribed, you're halfway to entering the competition, the giveaway competition that where we're going to release a giant X-Wing uh, Ultimate Collector's Edition. So make sure you go check out that video and find out how to enter to win. Okay, well, thanks everybody for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. Okay, bye-bye.